If ever there was a skid row in San Diego, this is it. This is also cleaning day on skid row, and the homeless have to move it or lose it. Our personal goods, our basic needs for survival. I mean, there's been a week where I've lost like most of my stuff, and I went a week without shoes. People who have not seen this in San Diego, it is a bit of a shocker. America's finest city has one of America's biggest homeless problems. Tent cities are everywhere in the East Village, and it's getting worse, not better. If someone from, like I said, if the city could, could, could team up and make more of a concerted effort, I think it would kind of reduce this blight and kind of help a lot of people. It would help the city, help improve the city's image. Dealing with homelessness is a very complicated formula. At the top of the list, mental illness and substance abuse. I end up homeless waiting to get into Serenity House up in Escondido. Serenity House is a rehab facility, but it only has so many beds for so many people. Along with some of the more complicated issues like mental illness and substance abuse, one of the biggest problems out here is the lack of affordable housing. There just isn't the housing here in San Diego. As of today, San Diego has the lowest vacancy rate in the country, only 2%. We also have some of the highest rents. At the end of the day, if we're really going to address this, it has to be through affordable housing. And now that it's been cold and raining, Father Joe's Village is doing what it can to keep people warm and dry. Once it gets colder than 50 degrees, and once there's more than a 40% probability of rain, we open it up. And even though I say that, it was open last night, and we had neither one of those uh, occur. And that was because we wanted to give some respite to, to those who are on the street, so we were able to do it. Last night, we accommodated about 93 individuals. One reason people don't go, they're afraid they'll lose all their belongings and their spot on the sidewalk. They stake a claim um, to a piece of um, sidewalk and they're afraid that if they do go in to our shelter for the night, they, they lose it by morning. And while some of these people may have given up, just as many people are doing everything they can to get off the streets. I try to accomplish at least five to ten goals. I try to make every day be as efficient and effective as I possibly can. And um, it, it's a struggle. A personal struggle for every one of these people. A complicated struggle with a very complicated solution. In the East Village, Dan Plant, KUSI News.